This video tutorial I will explain how to query multiple rows from the database table using a Spring JDBC template and Bean Property Row Mapper. Here you can see the employee table. It has three records. We will see how to get all these records. Using Bean Property Row Mapper, we can query or extract multiple rows from the database table as a list. Here you can see pom.xml. Here we have defined Spring dependencies and MySQL dependencies. Here I have defined a class employee. It has four properties employee ID, name, age, and salary. Here I have defined the interface uh, employee DAO. It has uh, one abstract method uh, find all. Here I have defined the class uh, employee DAO impl, which extends uh, JDBC DAO support class and uh, implements uh, employee DAO interface and provide implementation of uh, find all method. This method returns uh, list of employee objects. Here I have defined the SQL uh, select star from uh, employee table. Then I am calling uh, query method of uh, JDBC template object and passing uh, SQL and uh, bean property row mapper. This method get all records from uh, employee table and each record will be converted to employee object and those employee objects will be put it in the list and it returns the list which contains uh, employee objects. This is a Spring configuration file. Spring container read this uh, Spring configuration file and it creates a data source object. To create data source object, Spring container needs to know driver class name, URL of the database, username and password of the database. Once uh, data source object is created, it will be injected to employee DAO impl. Here I have defined a class uh, app. Here I have created uh, application context object by reading a spring configuration file using uh, getbean method of uh, application context object, getting uh, employee DO object from uh, spring container, then calling uh, find all method of uh, employee DO object. This method returns uh, employee list that I am printing here and also I am printing the size of the list. Here you can see the output. This is the first record of the employee table. This is the second record of the employee table. This is the third record of the employee table. And employee table contains uh, three rows. And uh, here we got uh, sizes uh, three. You can get uh, Java source code link from the description of the video. In mobile, to see the description, click on uh, this icon. It will expand like this and uh, here you can see the description. It contains uh, Java source code links. Click on these links to get the Java source code. 